In order to complete this free lesson, you are going to need to sign up for an account with Canva.com if you don't already have one. So head over to Canva.com and get signed up for an account. Um, you can just use the link below this video to get signed up for your, uh, your account. Now we are going to need the free um, I'm sorry, we are going to need the pro version of Canva in order to complete the background removal in this free lesson. Um, but don't worry, you can you can try it for free today. Um, or if you already have Canva, you just upgrade and you're going to be paying $12.95 per month. And I promise you, it is definitely worth it. So you'll just be using the pro version. Like I said, if you don't already have Canva.com, you're going to be able to try it for free. You're going to be able to try the pro version for free so that you can go along with the lesson. So head over to canva.com, get signed up to, for your account and get ready to go so we can jump right into this free lesson. How to make a header for your website quick and easy using Canva and it's going to look very professional. So once you get into your Canva account, okay, so you're going to scroll down you're going to scroll over and choose presentation. You want to choose the one that has the measurements of 1024 by 768. <clears throat> Excuse me. So click on that. Next, you're going to click on this one here. This is the one I'm going to be using. And I'm going to just click on the first page. Okay. So a few things. Let me close that out. I want to go ahead and... Just move that down there for now and remove that. Now I'm going to add an image. Okay, so go to uploads. I already have my image ready. And I'm going to be using this image of this lady here. Okay, so what I want to do is I want this background to be transparent. And with Canva Pro, I can remove this background with just one click. And I'm so excited about it. Okay, so with this image selected, all I need to do is click on Effects, Background Remover, just click on that, and watch the magic happen. And voila, the freaking background is removed. How beautiful. There's no nasty white edges. Everything looks clean. Everything looks great. Okay, so I'm ready to place her wherever I want to place her on this page. Okay, so next, let's just move this over. Let's see. Move that over. Now, take her. I want to make her larger. And I want to move her more towards the middle, about right here, okay? So now this wording, I'm going to make it a little smaller. And I'm going to put, uh, just going to make up a message here, okay? Let's go. Um, let's see. Wait a minute. Uh, maybe are you ready to earn just making up something guys whatever your tagline is is what you're going to put here okay so next i'm going to take this and i'm going to change it to white because i'm going to be placing it up here close that out move this up here and I'm just going to put a message in here. Uh, let's get started. Dot, dot, dot. And then I want to take this and I want to change the font. I have some saved fonts. You can choose whatever you like. Um, I'm going to try a few different things here. I'll try this one. I don't want it to be all caps. And I need this to be a little larger. And then I need the spacing on that, the letters to come in some. You want to take it a little bit bigger. Okay. Now, we'll move it down a little bit. You can adjust this to however you would like to adjust it. 
I'm so excited. Look at this. Look how good it's looking so far, okay? I'm going to remove this completely, okay? So that it's just her there. I can make her a little larger and bring her down a little bit. And let's say I want to make this, hmm, make it a hot pink color. Yeah, well, I like that. That's a good color there. Okay, and then let's say I want to add in some type of background, not this hand. I want to do something with like a laptop, okay? So I'm going to go here and I'm going to look for like a desktop. I really like this one. Okay, so this photo, this is a photo here. We are going to go ahead and remove this. So just click done, click on that, and then delete okay and that photo is gone now because I want to add my own so I'm going to add this computer screen here make it a little larger and then I'm going to flip it and then next I am going to actually put a filter on this and make it black and white and then I'm going to play around with the past the transparency and take it down. Okay. And one other thing, we want to make sure that this image here is all the way to the back. Okay, so that she is popping. All right. So you can just play around and position it like you want it. But I think I like that. And voila, look, the header is ready. Now we can just download this. Uh, download it as a PNG file. And it's ready to go. Okay, so now let's add this header to um, our website, okay? So click on header and we're going to change this image we're going to upload a new image which is our new header that we just created open that up insert that there now click on fill container and be centered Now let's remove the words, any words that we have. And now we're gonna actually add in some space. And we're just gonna keep adding space until it gets to as wide as we want it to be. Let's take a look, take a preview. And there you have your new website banner. And it is mobile friendly, guys. Now, of course, there are a few adjustments that we can make with sizing, but you get the gist. It does work. Look at that. Beautiful. If you enjoyed that quick free lesson, I have more for you. I can actually teach you how to design some of these custom flyers in Canva. I'm gonna teach you how to design like a pro using Canva. If you're sick of making bad flyer designs, trust me, I'm gonna give you my proven techniques and my hacks and you're gonna become a pro in no time. If you head over and get signed up today, I'm gonna to give you $10 off if you go ahead and get signed up. Take a look at the course, see if it's a fit for you, and trust me, you're going to be designing like a pro in no time. I've had so many students that have enjoyed the course and they are really seeing success. I hope to see you in class.